see offense on the field first. True freshman Ryan Norton kicks off. Marquise Lee. He brought one back 100 for a touchdown last week. Looked like he might have been grabbed by the face mask, and there is a flag necker. Two running backs behind him. The tailback is Curtis McNeil, the fullback. Soma Vanuku. Off in the flat it goes to Marquise Lee, chopped down immediately by the Knox. Don't you say sometimes Nassim tries to do a little bit too much. Silas Red in a running back now, the Penn State transfer. Lee Power in the loss to Northwestern. Four minutes played, no score. Barkley, another quick pop. This time it's Marquise Lee again, who stepped out of bounds. Right around. Syracuse stopped him on fourth down in the first possession. And some trickery. Flip to Marquise Lee. Great call. Lots of running room. Out of bounds. And find ways to get him the ball. They're coming off with the same look. The toss sweep. Then Marquise Lee, by his alignment, in position to run reverse and just put it in his hands, and he knows what to do. 22 yards. Trojan's poised for the first score of the game. The slant and the touchdown. Marquise Lee. Because Marquise Lee was covered. Look at the pump right there. He's covered, then he brought it back and re-delivered. Marquise Lee's showing guts, going up and catching the ball. The holding penalty wipes out a beautiful catch in a 14-yard game. They're back on the 7-yard line. It goes quickly to Marquise Lee. The ball's out and goes out of bounds at the third and six. Barkley out of the gun. That's a lateral to Lee. Nice moves behind the line of scrimmage. But work to do. He didn't get to the first down marker. But still, men have been open. He's been missing it. Silas Red, the lone back. After the procedure penalty, Barkley throws. Caught. And Lee is out of bounds. Alabama just throttled Michigan last week. Trojans say they aren't paying any attention to that. This time of the year, the polls really don't mean anything. And you kind of... Into nothing. Over a Syracuse team that has lost its last six games. Barkley slings one for Marquise Lee. Good blocking out wide. He's down the sideline. And out of bounds. Back at the 30 receivers. Again, they do a good job of game planning as you bring out number 82 for USC. Randall Telfer springing the block. The sideline. Not able to bat one down yet. Back to the run. Curtis McNeil. Swung down, finally wing, went forward. They're back at the 22. Third down and 12. For Robert Woods. Trying to turn the corner. What a play by Woods. Ryan Norton from Garden City on Long Island, another one of the Syracuse players playing in his backyard here today. Well covered as they stop. Two touchdowns, a little over two minutes for Syracuse. They're within five. 26 point underdogs. Marquise Lee. A chance to Barkley. First and 10 from the 28. Steady diet of this kind of play. Marquise Lee tackled Not along the college football trail. Second down and eight. Deep handoff to Red. He got rocked as he crossed the four. Barkley out of the gun. Thrown for just 161. Relatively low total. Three-man rush. And Keon Lynn is right there to make the... Down underneath with Robert Woods. Look there. Just a three-man rush. With Barkley giving a lot of time. Too much time. Syracuse decided to cover. And it might end up in a touchdown. Daniel Bryan transferring in out of the ACC to be the quarterback. Here's Robert Woods. Look out! Trophy front runner. He might not even be the best player on his own team. Throws the fade for Lee. Touchdown! Rashard Anderson had the cover. Rashard Anderson is going to try to jam him, but you'll see Marquis Lee do a little pass rush move with a little swim and push off. <laughs> it's just, you got to have strength. You got to have strength. Mm -hmm. and that onside kick with seven and a half to go. Do you like the onside kick try? Absolutely. Yeah. You have nothing to lose with this year. Yeah. Two scores down, and the way this bunch is starting to roll for USC, they anticipate they can well score again. If this defense is out of gas, it appears. Silas Red breaks all kinds of tackles and takes off again.
at running back. They were very thin there, and they lost D.J. Morgan, who would have been the number two tailback starting the year. He had a knee surgery. Tweet. And the pass is caught for a touchdown. Marquise Lee. And to start the game. And that was thrown to the outside of Marquise Lee. They can into a game. USC's been slowing down games in recent weeks. Silas Red's first carry of the game, and he's unable to get any two safeties deep. Third down and nine. Barkley with time. And he gets it complete to Lee, who makes a lunge. Front seven play against the run game. Play action. He gets it complete for a first down to Marquise Lee. All intelligence. They are the real deal. Oh, that ball is batted and still caught by Lee on the wide receiver screen. And then he dives ahead to the 20. He didn't travel this week, so the freshman gets the start. Single high safety. Second and 24 over the middle. That ball should have been intercepted. You're seeing a single high safety. That means on the outside is an opportunity, but also right here. They're going to try to get to that seam because the backer drops him. So there's a hole, a void right in between the safety. Barkley's three for three with three first downs on this drive converting. Let's see if he can pull this one off. And that ball is intercepted. Marquise Flower. Six quick. Marquise Lee from the two. And Lee still on his feet. Look at him go all the way out, pushing that pile to the 40. Barkley on first and 30. He's going to launch it downfield for Lee. Marquise Lee. Well, that solves the penalty problem, doesn't it? Just at the end, really well done. Why, right here, he slows it down and now finishes it. That's really, really well done. This kid, this kid is just a dynamic player. Nice tracking of the ball. Follows it all the way in with his eyes. All the fundamentals done right. 57-yard reception. And now quickly they get him to him. And he's going to reverse field, but hanging on to that shoe that time. Out there against Matt Barkley and Woods and Lee. DJ Morgan now the running back. And Marquise Lee. And they get eight yards here on the reception. Tackled by for three K State having real tests today. Another blitz, your man to man outside. Take your shot. And there he does. And it is batted away at the last moment by Jonathan McKnight, but a flag does come in. Yeah, that's that's good position. Now, oh, he puts his hand on the top shoulder. Yeah, that that's left arm call. coming around is what they saw. See that left arm pulling back, that left hand pulling back on the left shoulder of Marquise Lee. There is no foul on the play for pass interference. Wow. The receiver was not turned. Barkley looking for Lee, and he comes up with it. That was McKnight. And told his team, you've got to be kidding me. We've got to do better, guys. And he's the first one to do it that I've seen so far this game. That's a great point, Maria. You know, great. Four and five star type players they have on this roster. First down here, and Marquise Lee is wrestled down as they try to get after that foot. Third and seven. Barkley with time and with the completion. Marquise Lee, watch out. Goodbye, Hello Enzo. Right here, see McKnight is going to rotate to the middle of the field. He's going to give you that deep third. And then this is just an awful angle by McKnight. His job right here is to come downhill right there. See that? He got too high. He got this far. That way too much. And then... Look, as soon as as soon as he has a crack, Marquise Lee back in the top five. He was the no-brainer number one when the season started. Second and nine. Wow. Marquise Lee, what more can you say?
day another 31 yards added to his total yeah and so what they do is they take Robert Woods and they run him underneath along with the tight end and then bring him Jay Morgan in the back here second and 11 oh and tiptoe in the sideline is Lee see the hat come flying down at the bottom of your screen but it looks like he's in look at that footwork Rainey thought he had himself a pick. Well, they're letting it, they're letting it stand. He have gone out of bounds. So he must have reestablished himself in the in the field to play. Barkley. Right in stride and dive. And even when he's covered, he's not covered. Get your hands on him and run with him, but what? Lee. He has another ability that is very, very rare. Barkley looking for Lee and finding him. And here he goes again. Marquise Lee, touchdown. If these safeties back here take the angles, continue to take the angles they're doing on Marquise Lee, he'll get that record. Angles are a big part of, being, of playing safety. That's a bad angle. Here's another bad angle from the middle of the field. Once you get back there, it's anticipation, it's reading, the speed of the receiver. All they do is just go out each week and fundamentally beat every team they play. Here's Matt Barkley. Pumps once. Wide open, but just be Meanwhile, Marquise Lee down at the bottom of your screen. Yeah, just in case he won the 450. Yeah. That ball is going to be in key sleeve. First and 15. He's looking his way. He's able to find him as he cuts back against the grain and pushes ahead for nine more yards. They got to look at him, and they are. Seven. That's off the hands of Anuku, who's under center. The pitch. The reverse, Marquise Lee, can he get there? No! They were going to run it, especially when they moved most of the tight end back inside, but a great call in the redirect. Now watch, watch them rally inside out. That's an excellent job coming from inside and knowing where your help is. That's just well done all the way around. And a great effort by McKnight to go up and be aggressive and not wait for Lee to come to him. Went after the ball down on the sidelines. Marquise Lee is going to have a shot here. But they're able to find him. Sator here in Tucson. USC has had one loss so far this year. Number nine in the country. And now they need a comeback of their own. Marquise Lee. Uh -oh. Find running room. Marquise Lee. Can he get to the edge? Great routine this year with a new coordinator. Lead down the bottom of your screen. Second and ten. Barkley. Plenty of time. Has him. And he finds Marquise Lee, who goes backwards to try to get more yardage. And he does. Marquise Lee is going to make it. Red the lone back. Barkley. Back in the end zone. Who else? Marquise Lee. So watch, watch Marquise Lee's gonna come this way, all the way across. Here he comes. That's one way with a short field that you can use your speed, is just run across the field, and he does it. Linebackers gotta get out of there. They only bring three. Rush Over doesn't matter. Again, Marquise Lee. And he's out to the four. Need to get to the 33 to be within Hadari's range. Pumps once, downfield, takes a shot for Lee, but he overthrows him. Five, seven, from the 48. Barkley's going to crank it up. Incomplete. Arizona. Here's how it ended. Lee tried to give it one more shot off his left hand. 
on a day when he had 16 catches for 345 yards and two scores. First down and 10 of the 25 for Matt Barkley. Marquise Lee in motion. Barkley out of the shotgun on first down. This one picked up already. Pet time. Look to the left of your screen. This is where it's all going to happen. If you bring pressure, what do you have to do with your defensive backs? You have to make sure they're all tight. Keith Lee. Here in the first quarter, third down and eight. Underneath, intended for Lee, a flag on the play. Excited that his, his corners are uptight and challenging these receivers. The coverage is good. You just have to get your hands off of it. Ball's in the air. Hands have to be off. Pass interference. By the defense, no. For the Trojans. Here's the pitch to Marquise Lee, who lined up as a tailback. He's bottled up. Lee looking for a crevice and won't get it. Great pursuit by the Bruin defense, and they say they have the ball. Lee dancing, trying to go to the ground. Ball gets popped free as his knees going to the turf. That'd be a difficult one for our replay officials to break down. Is that the ball came loose prior to the runner's knee being down? It was recovered by UCLA. First down. 25. Barkley to the sideline. Incomplete. Mark receiver. Look to the right side of your screen. No backing off of the USC receivers right now. And they had a miscommunication on what's the route. Mark, you would have a lot of arched eyebrows, wouldn't you? Barkley to throw it. This time he finds his man, Marquise Lee. Nice move after the catch. Still going, and he's down. At Not sure I have him ahead, but the kid is definitely in the conversation. Here's a handoff, and it's Silas Red. I tell you what. And they'll run it. Get to the 25. They don't have enough. He's at the receivers. Second and two at the 48. Barkley to throw again. Deflected. Incomplete. Barkley. Marquise Lee. And Marquise Lee submarining. Barkley to fade in the corner. Flag on the play intended for Marquise Lee. Sheldon Price to the ball around. That's an appearance. By the defense, number 22. The ball will be placed at the two-yard line. First down. Look at Price working. There's a hand on Lee a little bit. And yes, he gets into his body before the ball gets there. Headlinesman all over the call. James Worry, I think he nailed it. In 1990. First to 10, Barkley. Sideline. Incomplete, Marquise Lee, the intended receiver. Donald to break it up. Second down and 10 at the 13. Barkley short drop this time. Going up top. Marquise Lee, incomplete. He got half. Tevin McDonald. Safety, TJ McDonald. And do you know what this play reminded me of immediately? The Super Bowl play. With Eli. Two at the 33-yard line. Curtis McNeil in the backfield. Here's Barkley on third and two. Incomplete. And you just wonder. And UCLA does a very nice job. Look at how they blanket everything. Not even really worried as much about the run. Here's Barkley to the sideline. Lee. Did he get? Yes, he did. He kept his feet in. Coming into this game, Jim Mora talked to us about he felt like for them, it was almost like the Rams Patriots Super Bowl of years ago when the Rams were the big, were the big. These wide receivers. First down, Barkley. Dangerous throw, looking for Lee. Some. Ten. Here comes a blitz. Barkley over the middle. Caught. Marquise Lee at, at tailback. Here's Barkley to Marquise Lee. And a flag on the play as Lee goes down at the Pass interference by the offense. Number 82 was blocking downfield. 15 yards from the previous spot. 
Replay, first down. And that's Randall Telford. So that'll be Telford here, lined up as an inline tight end on the line of scrimmage. See him blocking right there on the linebacker as the ball's being delivered. The back judge. Barkley, scrambling, Barkley. Gets rid of it and incomplete. And a flag, a late flag throw. Pass interference by the defense number 22. The ball will be placed at the spot of the foul. First down. Sheldon Price. Look at the bottom of your screen. He's all over Marquise Lee there. Ball's not in the air at that point, but right there. Before the ball gets there, he climbs on the back, and that's the call. Barkley, short drop. Intercepted by Kendricks. Here's Barkley. Steps up. Barkley looking. Lobs it up. Marquise Lee's got it! Inside the foot. But his footwork in the pocket is wonderful. And that allowed the opportunity for Marquise Lee to see him in trouble, convert his route, and go down. First down. Here's Barkley. Underneath Marquise Lee! Touchdown Trojan! How about this guy? Marquise Lee will get a shot from the six. And Marquise Lee gets a oh, Time not on their side. Barkley airing it out. Marquise Lee out of bounds at the 40. Coming forward, not anything getting behind them. They're going to take an extra couple of yards and back up in this situation. Marquise Lee over the middle. And Lee. Upended at the 40. 33 seconds remaining. Max Wittick in for Matt Barkley. Wittick underneath and caught by Mark. If you want to be a player, you got to kneel. Otherwise, you're going to be standing. McNeil steps off behind the left tackle, crosses mid. Fake handoff, goes deep, big arm, double teamed, firing to Lee. Off his hands, he had difficulty picking. Well, they're going to keep two guys on him, and they know that he wants to get vertical. The problem is he can still run right by Zeke Mata. Pretty good coverage there. They're trying to stay with him. Bennett Jackson's right there step for step, and by the time Marquise Lee located the football, Brent, it's bouncing off of his right arm. He never saw it. The passing game bogged down, so the... Richard freshman in his first start is going to put it up here on first down. Down 10. Comes back deep. Goes. And there's an interference call. Mark. This isn't the NFL, Marks right? Interference. Defense number six. 15 yard penalty. First down. Instead of the ball being placed at the 20 yard line, he realizes it with Lee's speed. And by the way, now we're really starting to see Wittick how far he can throw the football. That was over 60 yards in the air. But this time, Russell just says, you know what, I'm going to grab that arm. I'm going to take him down and not potentially give up this touchdown. Down on their own 40-yard line. Short drop, and they put it into Lee's hands with the short pass. And Telfer, the tight end, throws high, and Lee snaps it down. And there's second down for Max Wittick and the Trojans. In zone, high, touchdown. So they're having a guy like Marquise Lee. Two defenders are going to try to take him away. What happens is it frees up Woods to be able to get isolated one-on-one. -on -one. Watch the two defenders bracket Lee. They're so concerned about it. See how they lock in on his movement? Now Woods can work out individually one-on-one -on -one and be able to take Bennett Jackson over the middle, and he pulled... Runs up on this one, feels it at the nine, and the Irish bringing down. second down and nine. Pump fake, Whitick looks back to the right and comes in underneath to the fullback. Is what's been unique. Look at him come off this a little pump fake. Now he's looking for Marquise Lee, and then he comes to his third option. 
here tonight, isn't he? First down and 10. There comes Lee on that end around. Irish were ready for that play. Foot race. They surround him. And Florida State in Tallahassee. Here we go. First and 10 now. Minute 34 for Wittick. Let's see what they do here. Here comes the big arm. Going to fire deep. Wants Lee to run. And it's intercepted. Picked off by Russell. The, the play action and just said, I'm going to throw this ball because I think Marquise Lee can run underneath it as far as I can, and I think I can out-throw the defender. Give Russell a lot of credit because he does not let the speedster, one of the best playmakers in the country, back 11 runs and 11 passes. I think that alone has kept the front seven from Notre Dame a little bit on their heels. Marquise Lee, and he's brought down at about the trinket center in Holmes. Play action. Woody fires. Intercepted. Picked off by Manti. This is it. This is an amazing effort by Manti Tail. We've not called his name much tonight off of the play action. Watch him use his eyes to look this way, and then he turns around and looks up Marquise Lee. See him look back to locate him? Then he positions himself between the corner. 7 of 12. Last two pass attempts have been intercepted. This one a high percentage throw to Marquise Lee, and they have not been getting the ball to him. Giving hands off to McNeil. Trying the right side. Barkley is ready to take the snap up under center. And he will hand it off on first down. And speaking of Barkley, he is down below for two. Coming out, hesitated, then decided he wanted to try it. And the Irish don't let him get back to the bar. has had a huge year for Jim yes. Moore this year in the Bruins. Max Wittick back firing. Oh, and he couldn't spot the ball. Lee and Wittick not on the same page. He's got to get back outside. He waits too long to get outside. And you can see that. 1932 and 1984. So here we go. Trailing by nine. And rifles a first down pass to Marquise Lee. Finally get a chance to get the ball out to Marquise Lee. You can see the safety back there deep trying to prevent anything that's going to go down the field. It's forcing SC to show consistency with the first. We'll send Red behind the fullback first down and a first and goal. Looking toward Lee. Wittick from the gun high and incomplete. He overthrew number nine. Teo, Heisman candidate against Heisman candidate. He tries to get behind him. The ball is thrown high. Would have been obviously a tough. And the Trojans need a couple of scores, and there's somebody back who can give it to him in a hurry. Marquise Lee coming out. Don't want to let him free. Oh, is he so dangerous? The scores. And back on the field is Curtis McNeil. With it, with the big arm going long, one-on-one. -on -one. Lee grabs it, and Lee is to the one-yard line. And here's Lee right here who's going to go down in a wheel route. Here's Woods who's going to come here. They get one-on-one -on -one matchup. Watch Lee to the inside and the acceleration. He goes out and up against Bennett Jackson. The ball is actually, again, there's, it gives you an idea of that arm strength. The ball is thrown out in front of him. Great concentration. And finally, we see Wittick and Lee on the same page on a deep ball. Here's what's important after that 53-yard gain. Going to throw it. Penalty flag. First down. And he went on second down Back instead of waiting until third. Defense number six. Since the foul occurred in the end zone, the ball be placed at the two-yard line. First down. Notre Dame has shown this tendency to put Russell out there. And if they're willing to leave him against who a lot of people believe is the best player in the country, and your USC, whether it's Wittick or Barkley, you got to throw it. Played it again against him. Incomplete. And another flag flies. The back judge. Advantage of it. Pass interference. Defense number six. Penalty is half the distance to the goal. First down. Getting the least, if nothing else, a little bit of practice on throwing the fade ball to 
both times the ball is underthrown. 